Have you ever had a dream where a giant grape's been licking you? No. It's not a reoccurring dream for you? <laughs> no, Jeff, it's oh, not. Shoot. I'm Dave. I'm Jeff. Ethan from Save the Game Media sent us these in his giant box from Texas. So these are a Texas snack. They're weird. Look, they're just spoons. I don't they're know what... I, they look They look homemade. In, uh, Ethan, you have to forgive us. We're, we're uncultured and have no idea what these are. Chucha Rita Rita Rica Tamarind Flavored Candy Spoon. I don't know how we're supposed to eat these. I don't 1,080 know. 1,080 calories per pack. Per pack? Yeah. <laughs> well, there is a lot in this pack. Uh, if, you, if you want to see more Ethan, though, check out Save the Game Media. They have a show called I Hate My Friends where they argue about food a lot. But Ethan sent us this box, and we have to try it. You know, it says tamarind flavor candy spoon. Tamarind is not on the list of ingredients. What does this mean? <laughs> All right, I'm gonna let you bust this open. It's like where they say it's like cheese, like cheese singles or whatever, <laughs> or like cheese flavored craft cheese flavored singles with no cheese. It has no cheese in it. So I'm trying not That's to... why it says tamarind flavor. Okay, they are little. Are they Oops. little individually packaged? Yeah. And these are. This is just plastic. Yeah, so it's like. It's, it's, so it's like a sucker. Yeah, but why didn't they just make it a sucker? Like this is. <laughs> this is homemade. <laughs> it's a product of Mexico. Okay. Oh, and they, they use rubber bands. It's a rubber band. Oh, one. okay. Uh, Th this has to be homemade. I mean, it's got to come from a store still. Yeah, but it's like, it's like Lucy made it in her backyard. I need help. <laughs> uh, you know, just pull this. Here, I'll just take yours. Wow. Yep. Is this going to come out when I open it? Like, so what she said. That doesn't smell great, dude. <laughs> Does it smell like tamarind? Uh, Do you know what tamarind smells like? Uh, no. Neither do I. <laughs> right. I'm, I'm getting a little nervous. He sent us these these Chinese Japanese candies we tried at Extra Life, and they were the horrible. They were like, <laughs> well, let's try these. Out. I hope these aren't like some. Make sure I put it upside down so it gets on your tongue. Oh god, upside down, dude. No. Yeah. All right. Fine. Have you ever eaten something you don't know if you like it or hate it? Yeah, yeah, right now. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? Is a mystery flavor that I could continue licking just to see if I like it or hate it. It like starts out terrible, like absolutely just like. You can bite into it. I'm afraid to. It like starts out like bad spicy and then it it's tamarind. It transitions into like like a fruity kind of sweet spicy that I kind of like. Tamarind fruit ranges from sweet and sour to tangy and tart. That's exactly what this is. I can't decide if I like it or not. <laughs> so weird. I don't know. The mystery. Oh, I can actually get a little piece off. I get softened. You can chew off a piece. Yeah, you can. <laughs> take a bite, Dave. Dave. I did take I, a bite. No, I implore you. Just take a big chunk off <laughs> and tired eating it. Happy with that piece? Yeah, but why are you biting it sideways? Bite it like it's something on a spoon. <laughs> It's very strong in flavor. It's, 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 this is strength. wild weirdness. It's a big, strong flavor. It's a big daddy flavor. <laughs> this is something a kid would never like. No, absolutely not. And I can't decide whether I like it or not. Do you think it would go well with anything? No. Like toast or... It's no. too strong. It's too strong to be paired with anything. More tamarind. Yeah. I, I, I don't know what the purpose the of this base. is. I don't know if these are supposed to be like 
What do you mean? It's the purpose is it's a candy. I don't, I don't know if he's either sent this to be a joke or it's because it's, he likes these. I think he just grabbed something that was authentic to Mexico. It's a product to Mexico, Dave. You don't get these up here. All right. I, I, I'm so indifferent. I don't know what to rate these. I don't, like, I, these are, this is so weird. It's a flavor that you do not get up here. This is a very I, unique flavor to us. I feel like I need to mentally train myself to be so used to it that it doesn't stress kind me out. Kind of like a... Um, like coffee. No, even. what's that one? <laughs> what's that one what? What's that one flavor that Curtis brought? Uh, the durian? Yeah. We're not, no. This is better than durian. Yeah, but it's like an acquired taste. <laughs> yeah, no, it's def. this is definitely a taste that I'd have to work my way to before I'm just, like, opening up this bag of spoons and just eating them, like, suckers. Serving size is three pieces. I wouldn't be eating three pieces anytime no, soon. No. <laughs> One at a time. <laughs> One at a time. It's so strong in taste. Yeah, and I'm not really ready for it. Ethan, I do appreciate Is this savory or sweet to you? I don't know. That's the problem. It's almost a little sour at points, too. Yeah, I don't know. Guess that's Tamron. This is unexplainable. You know what else is unexplainable? Save the game media. Go check it out. Go watch I Hate My Friends with Ethan, who sent us this snack. I appreciate it. I made the conclusion. I don't like them. I don't. I I don't want more of it. No, neither do I. I I think if if I was, I don't know, it, more time with it, and I think I might grow to appreciate it. But I don't think I'm ready for this. You have twenty two pieces left. I know. Play us out, Adam. Thank you, Ethan. It's the Snack Network. It's the Snack Network. Oh, I tried. I tried and I tried to find something that I could rhyme with the Snack Network. But there's literally nothing. There's not a thing that you can rhyme with it.